Howdy partners, it's Paul with Weed in the Bush. How are you folks doing today? I'm out here stealth camping, Stealth Camping Alliance Cowboy Challenge. Dropped by Lisa's Day Off. Yeehaw, cowboys and cowgirls. It's uh, Paul with Weed in the Bush. And uh, yeah, as you can tell, we are we are in the bush. I got my cowboy hat on. That's uh, cloudy. It's going to be cloudy all night, and it will pro probably rain halfway through the night. So that's just something we're going to have to deal with tonight. But there goes a rabbit. We're at the fort. We're not going to stay at the fort tonight. We're going down there in the evergreens. This was just a good location. I knew it would be dry down here. It's been raining like crazy the last week. Crazy. But it is good to see that the fort's still here in one nice piece. So that's good. But let's let's get out of that. We don't need that crap tonight. I got is my tarp, my sleeping bag. Didn't even bring bug spray with me. That that might be a mistake. That that might be a mistake. This is the location that we're gonna find camp for the night. Someplace amongst these evergreens. So if it does rain, we should stay kinda dry. Okay, the bike's hidden right there. And uh, this time I came in through this this way here that's where the shoes are josh's shoes from hidden hammock that's where his shoes are and then the railroad tracks over there too partner let's go find a place to set up camp for the night pretty simple just a tarp and a sleeping bag and my cowboy hat uh hashtag stealth camping alliance cowboy challenge Lisa's day's day off. I did uh, go to the dollar store and try to buy some cowboy stuff, but this was it. Because we cowboys today, guys. We cowboys. I can tell you already, Lisa's going to have one heck of a time picking a winner. Picking the top five. Man, some of the previews I've seen already, mind-blowing. We got some stiff competition. But yeah, I gotta find a place to set up camp. Oh, bugs. All right, guys, I think this is the spot. It's pretty level. I got some shelter from the rain if it does happen. But yeah, let's get camp set up here. That's it, and if it does rain. We'll be protected. Yeah, well, now that camp's set up. Step two time, right? Yeah, and then I got my sleeping bag. And then the only luxury item I brought was a pillow. Because I'm bringing a pillow. So that. This camp set up. Easy peasy. Partners, we got some spinach. Spinach to eat. Smoke. Yes. This is Atomic Sour Grapefruit from Spinach. We're looking at 24.5% THC. Uh, these are not hand finished by anybody which I think I'm okay with I don't know if I really want hand finished joints hopefully this gets rid of the mosquitoes uh, I just I'm kind of just running out of time to get this cowboy camp challenge completed I can't do it next weekend and then the following weekend it's due so this is the time we got 
This is the time we're taking. We brought the motorbike, so I brought my horse powers with me. Horse powers are sitting in the trees, hiding. It is supposed to rain in the morning. It potentially could start at about two, three o'clock in the morning and then hit pretty hard around that 6.37. Mm. This is good. Uh, atomic grapefruit. Atomic sour grapefruit. Very sweet. Very sweet. Ooh. Got ourselves a stealth Pepsi. Oh, yeehaw, partner. Definitely needed that beverage down the gullet. Riding them horses, it takes a lot of work there, cowboys. Whoa, man, is that ever, it's almost sour. Wow, does that ever have a freaking citrusy taste to it, for sure. Uh, mosquitoes are gone. They don't like that, so that's good. Brought the alcohol stove. We roughing it. Sleeping on a tarp under the stars. There won't be any stars tonight, but they're out there, so it's all we can say. Well, cowboys, cowgirls, cows, atomic sour grapefruit. Yeah, uh, we'll do a, we'll do another one later to give it a proper review. Howdy. So I did set up a. Actually, no, I didn't set anything up. You can't see nothing right there partner uh, okay yeah so I did set up the tarp just in case it rains I mean I need a place to eat and like stuff right and so I just checked the weather ah uh, hmm yeah So yeah, that, uh, hmm. Yeah, that kind of changes things. That wasn't like that when I left to come out here. I checked. It was supposed to just rain a little bit in the morning and then get kind of heavy around 6, 30, 7 o'clock and I was kind of planning on to being gone by then anyways. Yeah. I got some thinking to do. Cowboy supper for tonight. We got some buttered buns and some chunky blazing roadhouse chili style soup. I had to bring the can opener. Yeah. And I'm gonna cook it on the alcohol stove powered by a gas line antifreeze because that's all I can find again in town. It's like nobody has any heat or anything like that so that's what we're using so we'll get that going that's gonna be tasty we got supper cooking partner well cowboys we got chili in a bun cooked over the alcohol stove worked perfect Mm. Mighty fine, mighty fine cooking, dear. Yeah, anyways, well, I got five of these to eat. Well, four and a half. So, 
I'm going to do that in a cowboy fashion. It hasn't rained yet. It was definitely black over in that area. And then out on this side, nice pinkish sunrise. Yeah, make sure you go check out the live stream. A lot of good stuff happens on the live stream. Okay, so yeah, quick update. Um, the weather did say it was going to rain. So just before the live stream, I changed my tarp configuration to maybe help deal with the rain if it did came, come, and the wind. And I also got me some night lights, some red solo cups. Cowboys like to drink. They like to drink out of red solo cups. They drink that draft beer. So, yeah. Um, as of right now, bedding is underneath the tarp because of the rain. Um, I check the weather again and it's questionable. I think when it is bedtime, I will go kind of set it back up at the top of the hill. And if it does rain, I'll just get up and we'll just come up underneath here and see what happens. Well, it's like 1120, but I am making a thing of hot chocolate. So that's getting cooked on the alcohol stove. And uh, we'll get that and then we'll smoke a bedtime joint. We finally got hot chocolate made. I don't think uh, that gas line antifreeze is much good. It had like six inches of dust on it when I picked it up. So, we got a nice grease covered joint. This will be zombie. And I guess to kick this joint off, since uh, it hasn't been much of a cowboy camp, except for the hats. I wrote you all a cowboy song. <clears throat> I live in the country, I live in the country. I live with the cows and the horses. But I don't live with my wife because she left me And I can't go check on my horses Cause my Ford won't start no more I'm a cowboy In a cowboy world My dog left me wife left me my Ford won't start no more no more that's kind of all I got so far I'm not a very good singer I don't sing I don't care to sing so you're welcome it uh, has clouded over quite severely And there's zero stars, so sorry Lisa, no stars, but uh, just this month was horrible. So, we're going to redo, we'll do it again, right? Can't just do a challenge once. Hot chocolate's good. There's greased up joints, burning nice. Uh, tonight's bad dad joke is brought to you by Ashkey Alien OG. Kind of goes along with this whole country cowboy thing. Uh, what do you what do you get when you play a country song in reverse? Uh, I'll let you think about it for a little while. 
and uh, yeah, we'll get back to you. I'd like to pause this joint smoking session for some membership updates. I'd like to throw a big shout out to Matthew, Jeff Purilator, and Anthony's Adventures. They are two month old members now. Fantastic, thank you guys. And then our new member for this month is La Shizzle. Thank you, sir. So we'll get you guys some content here. Nice and baked. Um, yeah, just nice. Gotta do start doing some more of these. Kind of did them all fall and then didn't do them all winter because it was too cold and then a late spring just fire them back up again. I like rosin and coated joints. Yeah, but tonight's bad dad joke is brought to you by Ashki Alien OG. What happens when you play country? music backwards you get everything back <laughs> all right because everything all the country music singers they just talk about everything leaving them and all the sad shit and all that shit and when you just reverse it you just you just get it back your wife comes back your dog back comes back your pickup truck comes back your ford starts like <laughs> uh, that joke was on the live stream, so if you were on the live stream and you heard it already, sorry, but I just, I had to use it. It's cowboy camping, right? Cowboy camping. It's uh, quarter to 12, so it's pretty late, and I think I want to be up pretty early and get out of here, probably 6 o'clock gone, 6.30 gone. Might be raining then, but it's all supposed to be raining now. Yeah, this was zombie with tea or uh, rosin coated grease. Jesus. Yeah, that's what it was. So yeah, I think next time you see me, guys, we'll be laying flat on the ground on a tarp. Lisa's day off, fantastic challenge. Lots of fun. I've had so much fun. The videos are going to be fantastic. Just go watch them all. Subscribe to them all. That's the tarp. Because that's the red Dixie cup lid light. And then I, here I am. Sleeping bag. Got the tarp. Hashtag South Camping Alliance. Lisa's day is off. So I think that's it for me tonight. Well, uh, if, uh, if it rains, you'll know. If it doesn't, we'll see you in the morning. Cowboy challenge. Night, y'all. Night, partners. Adios. I'll be back. Get into the chopper. It's four o'clock in the morning. It has just started to rain. Uh, so far, sleep's been pretty good. Uh, not cold. Not necessarily soft. Yeehaw, cowboys! 
I came under the protection of the tarp. I figured it's here. I may as well just use it. And then I'm not sleeping with the tarp, like, just over me. So, we're going to catch some more couple hours of sleep, and uh, we'll see what happens. Uh, it's kind of supposed to rain till about 6.30, 7 o'clock, so it's 4 a.m. now, so a couple, three hours of rain. We'll see what happens. Well, good morning, partners. Hope everybody slept well. I slept pretty darn good, honestly. It's definitely softer down here. Just the ground is a bit softer. Um, I did not get any wetness on me. Uh, there's definitely wetness around. Yeah, let's get up. We'll get this sleeping stuff cleaned up and we'll get some coffee into us. Morning, y'all. We got ourselves some coffee. Mm. Just instant coffee. But it's mighty good. It is, uh, yes, it's still raining. It definitely started to rain pretty hard while I was making coffee, but uh, it's uh, lightening up and it should actually stop by about 7 o'clock, so it's about 6.15 now, so. Uh, we got to give a review on this Atomic Sour Grapefruit. <clears throat> so let's, let's have a breakfast joint. Mmm, man, this has got some good flavor. Mmm. It's got that sour taste to it, but a very citrusy taste, but not overpowering citrus. It's almost the sour that's more overpowering. I flicked the cherry right off of it. Man, yeah, guys, she's just about done. Those half grammars, they smoke really fast. Taste is there. Burn quality is okay-ish. But the THC content just doesn't do it for you. Just doesn't. So... I mean, that's what that's what we're here for, right? We're here to get stoned. Obviously, it's nice to have some good tasting weed. But I'm only going to give it a 6.5 because I'm going to put this out and we're going to immediately reach into the bag of goodies here and grab one of my joints. And I'm still burning. Oh, oh, this is zombie, and this is good. I'm only going to give it a 6 out of 10, and I really think the only reason it's getting a 6 is the flavor. 6 out of 10 for the spinach. Atomic Sour Grapefruit. Uh, geez, sorry. I like spinach. They seem like a decent company. That one just didn't have the, the THC content to make me happy. Yeah, so guys, make sure you go follow all the hashtag Stealth Camping Alliance people. Um, especially Lisa's day off. She's the one who threw this challenge out and it was fun. Yeah, and I was gonna bring Ori along for this trip, just timing and just, it just, I had to get out and get it done. So I think we're gonna plan on doing a cowboy camp somewhere. Uh, he was pretty stoked to try it. So I, I think he's gonna be pretty disappointed that I went out and did it without him. So you will see another one of these coming from us. 
But yeah, guys, thanks for watching. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, that like button, that notifications bell. Uh, we got the munch fun, the buy me a coffee. Uh, it's, these joints are getting expensive. So, you know, you want to start throwing me five bucks to buy a joint? I'll buy a joint. We'll smoke that joint for you. This joint's for so, or this joint's from so and so. Right? Yeah, we had cowboy camping, right? Cowboy hats. Uh, that was it that I had for cowboy related stuff. We had a cowboy song. Uh, albums will be out here April 420th. And uh, yeah, we had cowboy hats. We cooked over the alcohol stove, just barely. Do all that subscribing shit. Uh, throw me a comment, bad dad joke. And uh, last night's bad dad joke was pretty funny. It was from that guy that I voice inputted because it was on the live stream and it just shit happened fast. Make sure you go check out the live streams. Lots of stuff, fun stuff happens there. We smoke lots of joints for about an hour. They're about an hour long. Um, yeah. So I'm gonna clean this up. We'll show you a camp tour when it's clean. We'll hop on our horse and we'll horsey on out of here. I don't know if my eyes are playing tricks on me. Something scurrying in the bushes. It's over in that direction. Uh, yeah, we're, we're done this joint. Super good. Here is campsite number one where I slept from about midnight till 4 a.m. The rain definitely come, likes to come for me at 4 a.m., eh? And then there is the tarp. You can actually see the dry spot. My bag's there. Just got a little tripod, take a couple sips of coffee. And we're out of here. Um, it's raining, so I'm not going to take you along. Yeah, well, this is uh, my version of cowboy camp. Uh, I slept on the ground on a tarp for about four hours. And then I slept under the tarp for about two hours uh, because of the rain. But I'm going to call that a successful cowboy camp anyways. There was no stars. There was going to be no stars unless I did it during the week and that was even going to be sketchy. So Lisa, that's what I got. Uh, just a bad month for cowboy camp. We got a couple months. Like I said, me and Ori are going to do it again. So we'll do it again and uh, we'll get some real stars or something this time. But anyways, guys, thanks for tagging along. Smoke weed every day. We'll see you in the next adventure. Peace. Yeehaw! Riding cow folk!